Hello, GFC kids. Are you ready to hear about the most epic duel in all of history? In the days of Elijah, there was a very evil king whose name was Ahab. And because Ahab didn't believe in the Lord, the Lord stopped the rain from coming down on Israel for three years. But King Ahab still didn't believe in the Lord. He believed in the fake god Baal. And so one day, the prophet Elijah went to the king and proposed this challenge. Bring the people of Israel to Mount Carmel and bring the 450 prophets of Baal. It will be time for the ultimate showdown. And so everyone met at Mount Carmel and Elijah said to all the people, it is time for you to decide who is the true God. I'm the only prophet of the Lord and there are 450 prophets of Baal and so here are the rules. You prophets of Baal get one bull, and I also get one bull. We will both place it on the wood, but won't light the fire. You pray to Baal, and I will pray to the Lord, the God who sends fire down to burn the meat. He is the true God. Baal's prophets went first and shouted and danced all day for Baal to send fire, but no one answered. Elijah made fun of them and told them to shout louder. Maybe Baal is busy or traveling or sleeping. So they shouted louder and cut themselves to get Baal's attention. But there was still no answer, not a single sound. Then it was Elijah's turn. He put the meat on the wood and poured water all over it until everything was completely soaked. Then he prayed to the Lord, and the Lord sent fire from above and burned up the sacrifice, the wood, the stones, and all of the water. When the people saw this, they shouted, The Lord, He is God! The Lord, He is God! Elijah told the people to catch all the prophets of Baal and to kill them, and the people listened to Elijah. Then Elijah told King Ahab to leave, because a huge rainstorm was about to come. So Ahab left, but there was still no sign of rain. Elijah prayed and told his servant to go and look towards the sea. But the servant saw nothing. After looking seven times, the servant finally saw a small cloud. And soon enough, dark clouds filled the sky and rain poured down and Elijah was filled with God's power. Remember that the Lord was the winner of this epic duel because He alone is the true God.